I'm in Norway with what feels like a monster shark on the end of my line. Here we go. Just lean back. Lean it back. Yeah, got it. Good. There it is. Ah, yes. Yes, 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 yes. It's a wide one. It's a very wide one. It's a feisty one. It's a very feisty one. It's a 10-foot Greenland shark. Where's the other end? Here, got it here. So it's a big male shark. We can see from the clusters that they are very well developed. Julius and I have just minutes to examine, tag and release this shark. The process punctures the thick skin but doesn't harm the animal. These satellite tags will record how far and how deep this shark swims over the next six months. For me, though, it's all about size and power. So this is this is the girth. So uh, that is how how wide around the body this animal is. I reckon this shark weighs around 700 pounds. Julius estimates it's roughly 200 years old. It's one of the biggest and certainly the oldest fish I've ever caught. It's truly awe-inspiring to look at this creature up close, a monster that few people ever see. And this daylight encounter has told me what I needed to know. Well, this is what I came to Norway for. What I wanted to see was um, a live Greenland shark in the daylight up on the surface so I could get a really good look at it. And also, the other thing was just feeling it on the line the sharks that I pulled in didn't seem like docile scavengers. Their powerful bursts of energy were those of a beast that can react fast to moving prey. A hunter that knows its own strength and how to use it. Add to that the highly specialized teeth and you could be looking at a very capable predator. Today, uh, we have made a significant step towards getting a much fuller picture of this very, very strange elusive shot.